All right, y'all, I'm back out here on the river. Uh, today I'm gonna be going over two ways that uh, I fish a spinner. It's just two little methods, very simple methods. You might already know them. But anyway, I'm gonna go over it and show y'all anyway. Anyway, we're just out here. We're gonna see if we can't get on some wild trout. Um, see if they're chasing, see what they're doing, see if they're active. They should be active today um, with, uh, with it warming up, with spring coming up. Uh, these fish should be chasing but anyway we'll see and uh y'all stay tuned and if you like this video video go ahead and uh hit that like button it uh really help out the channel but anyway appreciate y'all and uh i'll get to fishing <laughs> So today I'm using my Daiwa Procaster 2500 and got a one eighth of an ounce rainbow tinsel rooster tail and about a foot up from it got a barrel swivel keep line twists out of my line that's what I'm using There he is, y'all. Good one. Ooh, decent rainbow. Oh, he's coming upstream. Hey, that's a nice wild rainbow. I'll take it. I'm just holding that spinner, fishing downstream. And this guy just had to have it. Oh man, what a beautiful trout. Goodness. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, man. He's, look at the colors on this guy. Beautiful. I'll tell you, I'd much rather fish for wild trout than stock. It's just something about it. I mean, it's more of a sport, more challenging, and a lot more fun. Wet my hands, we'll look at this guy, and we'll get him back. Look at that, man. amazing. Beautiful. See you, buddy, appreciate you. I'm gonna get right back in there and see if we can get another one just fishing it downstream like that. Very effective way to catch these trout. One reason you uh you get it in front of that fish a lot longer and they'll have to hit it. I see that little flashy spinner just a bling blinging in that water. Oh, there he is, another one. Very effective way. Another beautiful rainbow, y'all. Beautiful. All right, y'all. There he is. Just let him go. See, you, buddy. Ooh, there he is. Third one out of that pocket. Oh, he feels good. Oh, we lost him, y'all. Lost him. What we have here is a lost fish. I'm gonna get right back up here. And that's all I'm doing, y'all. Very simple. Just casting out. Just tossing her out there a little bit. 
and you can let you line out about how far you want it down or whatever i'm gonna work it a little bit on down from where i was earlier and you just hold it in that current well it works better if you get it in a little stronger current you can just hold it there I'm gonna work this section right down here real quick. I'm doing that. So again, all I'm doing is tossing it down, just holding her there in that current. Slowly reel, just enough to keep it from getting hung on the bottom. Like so. That's how I got. And fish it's right back there yonder. Oh, there he is. that y'all pretty little wild brown nice look at him pretty send him back Come on back for it. Come on, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh, man. <laughs> man, two of them chased it all the way. All the way from way up there, all the way to right here. And I just kept pulling it because sometimes if you stop, they'll just go on. So, man, he chased it all the way right there and he's barely nicked at it right at the end. Hey. Well. You can tell springs here because these fish are getting active, they're chasing. I'm loving it. Loving it. And they ain't none of it. these ain't stock fish either. These are wild. Alright, y'all. We got us another good pocket right here. A little more shallower right on this side. Comes around on that far right side. Pretty good and deep as it's washed out that bank right up in there and uh now i'm gonna show y'all uh, another effective way that i throw a spinner so this way uh oh drop my net here get my net might need that right. so i'm gonna sneak up here a little closer be very quiet and stealthy as i can be so this way I'm going to show you now, it's just fishing upstream. Good thing about fishing upstream, you can sneak up behind the fish. You sneak up behind them, and then you throw your spinner out, and then you just reel it down. If it's a real deep section, as soon as your bait hits the water, let it sink a minute, and then just start reeling, slowly reel. And, uh, all right, let's give her a try. All right, it's a little deep there, so I'm gonna let her sink just a little bit. All right, I'm gonna start reeling. And didn't even get a follow. I cannot believe it. I might be over on this far right side of one. So usually, this right here, this way looks more natural to fishing upstream. And like I said, you sneak up behind them because these fish are looking upstream and you sneak up behind them and get your cast in. And... Come on, where y'all at? Ooh, got one chasing. Had one chasing. I don't know, he might've seen me, changed his mind. 
got a little pocket over here to the right and see what we got right up in here nothing Good little spot right in here, y'all. You can see right up here, we got them two trees leaning over. Right up along in that area, close to the bank right in there. It's real deep. Well, I say real deep, but it gets deeper. I don't know, maybe three foot. Beat one holding in there, and there he was. All right, man, good quality trout. Man, that is just a beautiful wild trout. Amazing. Look at how beautiful this guy is. There he is, y'all. Let him go. See you, buddy. Appreciate the fight. Thank you, Jesus. So, yeah, see y'all. There's, like I was showing you on casting upstream. You sneak up behind them. Cast upstream. Reel it down. It just looks natural. Just like food. Or it looks like a little minnow just flowing down there with your spinner. Well, y'all, I'm going to call it home fishing for today. Uh, got out here, caught some nice rainbows. Um, they were very active. They were chasing. It's good to see them chasing. Uh, it's always fun to see them chasing in clear water. Anyway, just showing y'all two little methods that I use uh, while fishing a spinner. Uh, they work good for me. If you, if you can't get them to hit casting upstream, uh, usually downstream we'll usually get them but anyway I hope this video was helpful to y'all uh, anyway appreciate y'all y'all take care and uh, don't forget to like this video if you like it and uh, hit that subscribe it really helped me out and uh, yeah see y'all on the next one appreciate y'all have a good one